Hello and welcome to our channel. In this video, we're going to discuss on, Are you a slave to money? 20 signs you need to take control. Money is a necessary part of our lives, but when it becomes an obsession, it can take control of our thoughts, actions, and even our relationships. Hey there, and welcome to Double Z. This channel is all about helping you achieve your financial goals and live your best life. From budgeting and investing to building wealth and finding balance, we've got you covered. So, if you're ready to take control of your finances and your future, you've come to the right place. Let's get started. Number 01 You're always stressed about money. Money is the number one source of stress for Americans, according to a survey by the American Psychological Association. Financial stress can have serious consequences for your mental and physical health, including anxiety, depression, and even heart disease. If you're always worried about money, it may be controlling your life. Number 02 You measure your self-worth by your income. Your self-worth isn't tied to your net worth. There are plenty of wealthy people who are miserable, and plenty of people with modest incomes who are happy and fulfilled. In fact, studies have shown that happiness and income are only weakly correlated. If you feel like your value as a person is tied to your income, it may be controlling your self-image. Number 03 You spend money you don't have. Using credit cards or loans to pay for things you can't afford can lead to a vicious cycle of debt and financial stress. In fact, the average American has over $6,000 in credit card debt. If you're spending money you don't have, it may be controlling your behavior. Number 04 You're always looking for the next big thing. Consumerism is a powerful force, but it can also be a trap that keeps you in a never-ending cycle of spending. If you're constantly chasing the latest gadget, car, or fashion trend, it may be controlling your desires. Number 05 You work long hours even if you don't enjoy it. Working long hours to earn more money, even if you don't enjoy the work, can have serious consequences for your health and happiness. Studies have shown that working long hours is linked to a higher risk of depression, anxiety, and heart disease. If you're sacrificing your health, happiness, and relationships for the sake of your bank account, money may be controlling your priorities. Number 06 You're jealous of people who have more money than you. Wealth doesn't guarantee happiness, and there are plenty of rich people who are unhappy and unfulfilled. In fact, studies have shown that after a certain point, more money doesn't lead to more happiness. If you feel envious of people who have more money than you, it may be controlling your emotions. Number 07 You're always looking for ways to make more money. If you're always searching for ways to make more money, even if you don't need it, it may be controlling your mindset. This can lead to a workaholic lifestyle and an inability to enjoy life outside of work. Number 08 You have trouble saying no to others. If you have trouble saying no to requests for money from friends or family, it may be controlling your relationships. You might be putting yourself in a difficult financial situation to avoid disappointing others. Number 09 You judge others by their income. Wealth doesn't define a person's character, and there are plenty of kind, generous people who have modest incomes. If you judge people based on their income or material possessions, it may be controlling your values. Number 10 You feel like you can't take a break. If you feel like you can't take a break from work or your financial obligations, it may be controlling your freedom. You might be missing out on important moments with family and friends because you feel like you can't take time off. Number 11 You're always worried about the future. While it's important to plan for the future, it's also important to enjoy the present moment. If you're constantly worried about your financial future, it may be controlling your anxiety. Number 12 You feel like you're not doing enough. If you feel like you're not doing enough to earn or save money, it may be controlling your sense of worth. But remember, there's more to life than just money. It's important to prioritize your physical and mental health, relationships, and personal growth. Focusing too much on money can lead to burnout and a lack of fulfillment. Number 13 You're constantly comparing yourself to others. Comparing yourself to others, especially in terms of money and possessions, can be a never-ending cycle of dissatisfaction. There will always be someone who has more than you do. Instead, focus on your own goals and values, and strive to be the best version of yourself. Number 14 You're always trying to keep up with the Joneses. Trying to keep up with your neighbors or peers can lead to overspending and debt. 
You don't have to live up to anyone else's standards or expectations. It's important to live within your means and prioritize your own financial goals. Number 15. You're afraid to take risks. Fear of financial loss can hold you back from taking risks and pursuing your dreams. While it's important to be responsible with your money, taking calculated risks can lead to growth and opportunities. Don't let money control your willingness to take chances. Number 16. You feel guilty for spending money on yourself. It's important to treat yourself and enjoy the fruits of your labor. Feeling guilty for spending money on yourself can lead to a negative relationship with money and a lack of enjoyment in life. Find a balance between saving for the future and enjoying the present moment. Number 17. You're always thinking about the next paycheck. If you're always living paycheck to paycheck, it can be hard to enjoy the present moment and plan for the future. It's important to have a solid financial plan in place and save for emergencies and retirement. That way, you can enjoy the present without worrying about the future. Number 18. You're willing to compromise your values for money. Compromising your values, ethics, or morals for financial gain can have serious consequences for your self-worth and reputation. Don't let money control your decision-making and always prioritize your values and integrity. Number 19. You feel like you can't talk about money with others. Money can be a taboo topic, but it's important to have open and honest conversations about finances with your partner, family, and friends. Don't let money control your relationships or prevent you from seeking advice and support when needed. Number 20. You don't have any financial goals or plans. Without clear financial goals and plans, it can be hard to stay motivated and focused on your financial well-being. Set achievable goals and create a plan to reach them. Let us explain all these points elaborately, be with us. If you're always worried about paying your bills, saving for the future, or living within your means, it can cause chronic stress. This stress can have serious consequences for your mental and physical health, including anxiety, depression, and even heart disease. If you're always stressed about paying your credit card bills, it can lead to sleepless nights, irritability, and a lack of focus at work. If you believe that your worth as a person is directly related to your salary, you may feel inadequate or ashamed if you lose your job or take a lower paying job. This can lead to feelings of depression and anxiety. If you buy a new car that you can't afford with a high interest loan, you may struggle to make the monthly payments and end up accruing more debt. This can lead to a cycle of financial stress and anxiety. If you constantly buy the latest gadgets, fashion trends, or cars, you may be spending more money than you can afford. This can lead to financial stress and an inability to save for the future. If you work 80 hours a week in a high-stress job, you may be sacrificing your health, relationships, and personal growth for the sake of your bank account. This can lead to burnout and a lack of fulfillment in life. If you feel jealous of your friend who just bought a new car, you may be focusing on what you don't have instead of appreciating what you do have. This can lead to a negative relationship with money and a lack of gratitude in life. If you take on a second job or side hustle to earn more money, even though you already have enough to cover your expenses, you may be sacrificing your free time and personal growth for the sake of your bank account. If your cousin asks you to lend them money to start a business, even though you don't have the extra cash to spare, you may feel guilty saying no and end up putting yourself in a difficult financial situation. If you look down on someone who has a lower paying job than you do, you may be prioritizing money over kindness and empathy. This can lead to a negative relationship with money and a lack of fulfillment in your social interactions. If you feel like you can't take a break from work or your financial obligations, it can be a sign that money is controlling your freedom. If you feel like you can't take a vacation because you can't afford to take time off work or pay for travel expenses, you may be sacrificing your mental and physical health for the sake of your finances. If you're constantly worried about saving enough for retirement, you may be sacrificing your present enjoyment and fulfillment in life. This can lead to a lack of gratitude and a negative mindset. If you feel guilty for not working enough overtime or not saving enough money each month, you may be prioritizing money over your personal well-being and fulfillment. If you're constantly comparing your salary to your co-workers or your car to your neighbor's car, you may be focusing on what you don't have instead of appreciating what you do have. This can lead to feelings of inadequacy and dissatisfaction. If you feel like you need to buy a new car or house because your friend just did, 
you may be sacrificing your financial stability for the sake of appearances. This can lead to a negative relationship with money and a lack of financial security. If you're afraid to start your own business or invest in the stock market because you're afraid of losing money, you may be sacrificing potential growth and opportunities. This can lead to a lack of fulfillment and regret later in life. If you feel guilty for buying a new outfit or going out for a nice dinner, you may be sacrificing your own happiness and enjoyment in life. This can lead to a negative relationship with money and a lack of self-care. If you're always worrying about how you'll pay your rent or bills until your next paycheck, you may be sacrificing your mental and emotional well-being for the sake of financial survival. This can lead to chronic stress and a lack of fulfillment in life. Compromising your values, ethics, or morals for financial gain can have serious consequences for your self-worth and reputation. You're willing to cheat or lie to get a promotion or make more money. You may be sacrificing your integrity and personal values for the sake of financial gain. This can lead to a negative relationship with money and a lack of self-respect. Money can be a taboo topic, but it's important to have open and honest conversations about finances with your partner, family, and friends. If you're hesitant to discuss your financial struggles with your partner, you may be sacrificing the opportunity for support and advice. This can lead to a lack of trust and communication in your relationships. Without clear financial goals and plans, it can be hard to stay motivated and focused on your financial well-being. For example, if you don't have a budget or savings plan, you may be sacrificing your financial security and future stability. This can lead to a lack of direction and purpose in your financial life. Money is an important part of our lives, but it shouldn't control us. By being aware of the signs that money may be controlling you, you can take steps to regain control of your finances and your life. Remember, there's more to life than just money. Prioritize your health, relationships, and personal growth. Take control of your finances and your life, and enjoy a fulfilling and balanced life. It's important to be aware of the signs that money may be controlling your life. By taking control of your finances and your priorities, you can enjoy a fulfilling and balanced life. Thank you for watching our video, we hope you found it informative and helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more great content.